Let's get it, Kansas City. Let's get it, Kansas City. This is Eric Berry, the Chiefs' strong safety, drafted in 2010. This is war paint, a Chiefs' tradition, started in 1963 and revived in 2009. After any interception, Barry tries to run the ball back for a touchdown. Still on his feet and moves to the near side. He's inside the 20, inside the 15, 10, 5, touchdown for Eric Barry. After every touchdown, Warpaint takes a victory lap around the stadium. Few knew there was a problem until midway through the 2012 season. Oh, hell no, they go that horse. I don't f with that horse. Huh? That horse. Yeah, I'll wait till they got to the horse pass. I don't mess with horses, bro. Might come over here and throw a tantrum. Stay inside the box, stay inside the box. Oh. Hold up, coat that horse out there. The horse. She need to go ahead with that horse now. I don't fool with no horses, boy. Like Hell no. I see the the first game. I ain't worried about the chick. I'm worried about the horse. It's called equinophobia, the fear of horses. Equino what? Twilight stars Kristen Stewart and Robert Pattinson share this fear. Then again, they don't share a stadium with a horse. Every time we go out, he's always watching for the horse, making sure the horse doesn't look at him or do something crazy. I'm trying to watch him. They sneaky. As long as it's like... 10, 15 people between me and the horse, I'm good. Everybody is born with a choice, and I'm making the choice not to deal with the horse. That's weird. Like, all out scared? Yeah, it's a little softness to me. <laughs> in college, Barry was no scaredy cat. He was voted the nation's best defensive back as a junior. If anything, opponents were afraid of him. Every Barry, 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 Joey scary. Joey scary. Tell the other team, homie, don't you dare me. Don't you dare me. Every Barry, every Barry. Every Barry. Barry was a second generation volunteer after his father James, a Tennessee captain in the early 80s. You know, my dad talked a lot of trash. He was like, if it was me and you in the open field, you, you couldn't handle me. You know what I'm saying? Like, straight like that. And like, I think the best thing that happened was when YouTube came out, I looked up his highlights and like, he was straight balling. And Barry did a lot of that on his own. To actually see it, it's like, all right, he does know what he was talking about. <laughs> I want to see you guys picking your knees up, moving your arm. The engine ain't gonna go nowhere unless you pump those pistons, you got it? I was always the coach. I started coaching him from the age five all the way up to 14. He was definitely hard on me, but 95% of my stuff I learned from Pops. Y'all gonna be glad to get to my station when you get over there. We gonna put some work in today. I still hear him in the back of my mind, like, you need to pick it up. Get in there. Come on, come on, come on. Go. That's not sprinting. I want to see you explode off of that. You need to finish this drill. Why you slow down out there? What's the name of the game? Finish. Finish. Finish the drill. Don't overlook the small things. Hey, captain, get your team in order. I know. Get your, you the captain, get your what? team in order. Let's go. You know, he showed me how I needed to be on myself to have a shot at the NFL. Hey, let go, bro. Everybody got to lock in right now. Right now, we on the mission. I need everybody today. Family on three. One, two, three. Bang. In 2010, Barry became the first Chiefs rookie since Derek Thomas to make the Pro Bowl. In 2012, he had to fill in at cornerback due to injuries and made the Pro Bowl again. He's one of the most athletic safeties you'll see. He has cornerback skills. He can tackle. They line him up at linebacker sometimes. Play behind right tackle. The oh. hit in the backfield. Eric <laughs> Berry. I mean, the guy could do it all. Let's go, D. Berry's only weakness seems to be equine in nature. In his defense, there's a precedent. Look at this again. <laughs> hey. <laughs> We all have our phobias and things that, you know, a lot of kids are just scared of being in the dark or whatever. I sort of think it's hilarious that he's afraid of horses. Don't mess with no horses, Cor. How did that happen anyway? Something happened to him as a kid to make him afraid of horses? I know he ended up at a petting zoo. You know all the cartoons and all the TV shows you see when you're young? Like, horses and ponies are always really, really cool and happy. They always got like a rainbow or some stars flying behind it. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, it's a pony, it's a pony. So, like, I'm at the petting zoo, and for some reason, the pony came and bit me. When it happened, and I turned around and looked at it, 
aside from the fact that the horse didn't look anything like the cartoon or what I saw on TV, it was like, dang, horse, like, I trusted you. You know what I'm saying? Like, I was really betrayed. Childhood traumas can be, well, traumatic. Fine. <laughs> but Barry was willing to try anything to get past it. I think I can beat this man. And possibly one day I could appreciate horses for who they are. Gentle and graceful creatures. The carrot at the end of the stick was a meeting with war paint herself. The final hurdle in Barry's steeplechase of fear. He's gonna visit with war paint tomorrow. The only advice I can do is just stare him down. <laughs> Baby steps, man. Rome was not built in one day. Hi, Eric. Hey, how I'm you doing? I'm Susie, nice and I'm War Paint's rider. Yeah. And I'm just going to tell you, she is seriously the nicest horse. Literally, she goes to schools, and like hundreds of kids come up to her, and she's never, you know, ever hurt anybody, ever. So I know that she would absolutely do nothing if you were to go up and pet her. She'd probably actually really love it. Do you Whoa. have a dog? Yeah, I got a dog. It's not dog. that big. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you go first. I'm going to walk behind you. She really likes it when you pet her right here. Yeah. Yeah. Very good. Yeah. And they like it too when you pet them right here because that means they're doing a good job. Good so job. I'll, you'll whoa, see me. whoa. Just yeah. stay there. Good job. Very good. Um, yeah. I got an extra cowboy hat over there if you want to put it on and touch her. I'm cool. <laughs> <laughs> I'm good for another 10 years. <laughs> War paint, I'm sorry I uh, talked about you like that on TV but I feel like we are making strides to a good relationship for the years to come in Kansas City. Just kind of slow it down a little bit on the field. And yeah, we're cool. I'm perfectly fine right here. <laughs>